There are 52 stellar systems beyond our own solar system that currently lie within 5.0 parsecs .3 light -years of the Sun. These systems contain a total of 63 stars, of which 50 are red dwarfs, by far the most common type of star in the Milky Way. Much more massive stars, such as our own, make up the remaining 13. In addition to these true stars, there are 11 brown dwarfs objects not quite massive enough to fuse hydrogen, and 4 white dwarfs extremely dense objects that remain after stars such as our Sun exhaust all fusible hydrogen in their core and slowly shed their outer layers while only the collapsed core remains. Despite the relative proximity of these objects to Earth, only nine not including the Sun are brighter than 6.5 apparent magnitude, the dimmest magnitude visible to the naked eye from Earth. All of these objects are located in the local bubble, a region within the Orion Cygnus arm of the Milky Way. Based on results from the Gaia Telescope's second data release from April 2018, an estimated 694 stars will possibly approach the solar system to less than 5.0 parsecs 16 light -years over the next 15 million years. Of these, 26 have a good probability to come within 1.0 parsec 3.3 light years, and another 7 within 0.5 parsecs 1.6 light years. This number is likely much higher due to the sheer number of stars needed to be surveyed. A star approaching the solar system 10 million years ago, moving at a typical sun relative 20 to 200 kilometers per second, would be 600 to 6000 light years from the sun at present day, with millions of stars closer to the sun. The closest encounter to the Sun so far predicted is the low-mass orange dwarf star Gliese 710, HIP 89825 with roughly 60% the mass of the Sun. It is currently predicted to pass 19,300 plus or minus 3,200 astronomical units 0.305 plus or minus 0.051 light years from the Sun in 1.280 plus 0.041 minus 0.039 million years from the present, close enough to significantly disturb our solar system's Oort cloud. The easiest way to determine stellar distance to the Sun for objects at these distances is parallax, which measures how much stars appear to move against background objects over the course of Earth's orbit around the Sun. As a parsec parallax second is defined by the distance of an object that would appear to move exactly one second of arc against background objects, stars less than five parsecs away will have measured parallaxes of over 0.2 arcseconds, or 200 milliarcseconds. Determining past and future positions relies on accurate astrometric measurements of their parallax and total proper motions how far they move across the sky due to their actual velocity relative to the Sun, along with spectroscopically determined radial velocities their speed directly towards or away from us, which combined with proper motion defines their true movement through the sky relative to the Sun. Both of these measurements are subject to increasing and significant errors over very long time spans, especially over the several thousand year time spans it takes for stars to noticeably move relative to each other. Topic. List The classes of the stars and brown dwarfs are shown in the color of their spectral types these colors are derived from conventional names for the spectral types and do not represent the star's observed color. Many brown dwarfs are not listed by visual magnitude but are listed by near-infrared J-band apparent magnitude due to how dim and often invisible they are in visible colors. Some of the parallax and distance results are preliminary measurements. Topic maps of nearby stars Topic Distant future and past encounters over long periods of time, the slow independent motion of stars change in both relative position and in their distance from the observer. This can cause other currently distant stars to fall within a stated range, which may be readily calculated and predicted using accurate astrometric measurements of parallax and total proper motions, along with spectroscopically determined radial velocities. Although predictions can be extrapolated back into the past or forward into the future, they are subject to increasing significant cumulative errors over very long periods. Inaccuracies of these measured parameters make determining the true minimum distances of any encountering stars or brown dwarfs fairly difficult. One of the first stars known to approach the Sun particularly close is Gliese 710. The star, whose mass is roughly half that of the Sun, is currently 62 light years from the Solar System. It was first noticed in 1999 using data from the Hipparchos satellite, and was estimated to pass less than 1.3 light years from the Sun in 1.4 million years. 
With the release of Gaia's observations of the star, it has since been refined to a much closer 0.178 light years, 0.055%, close enough to significantly disturb objects in the Oort cloud, which extends out to 1.2 light years, 0.37%, from the sun. The second closest object known to approach the sun was only discovered in 2018 after Gaia's second data release, known as 2MASS J0610 4246. Its approach has not been fully described due to it being a distant binary star with a red dwarf, but almost certainly passed less than one light year from the solar system roughly 1.16 million years ago. Topic see also topic Notes topic References topic External links The 100 Nearest Star Systems, Research Consortium on Nearby Stars and Stars Database. Northern Arizona University. Archived from the original on October 30, 2005. Retrieved October 24, 2005. Nemiroff, R., Bonnell, J., eds., March 18, 2001. Map of the 25 nearest star systems. Astronomy picture of the day. NASA. Retrieved 24 October 2005. Notable nearby stars. Sol Station. Retrieved 24 October 2005. Cool stars in the solar neighborhood. D. Montes, UCM. Retrieved 14 November 2005. The Dynamics of the Closest Stars Takeda, G., E. B. Ford, A. Sills, F. A. Rossio, D. A. Fisher, J. A. Valenti 2006. Structure and Evolution of Nearby Stars with Planets 2. Physical Properties of Tilde 1000 Cool Stars from the Spock's Catalog. California and Carnegie Planet Search. Retrieved 13 October 2006. Nearest Stars 3D View Table 4 The Census of Stars and Brown Dwarfs Within 8 Parsecs of the Sun in Baylor Jones, C.A.L., et al., 2012. Further defining spectral type y and exploring the low mass end of the field brown dwarf mass function. The Astrophysical Journal. 753 2, 156. Archive, 1205.2122. Doi 10.1088/0004-637x/753-2156. HTTP colon slash slash PHL dot upper. Adu Projects Nearby Stars Catalog.